Hi, my name is Kwame Emma McPherson. The title of my story is Okohi, and it's O-C-O-E-E. It's a Cherokee Native American Indian name, which when turned, when anglicized, means apricot vine place. I'm a Jamaican residing in Jamaica, as you can tell, sunshine and beautiful greenery. And my story is based on African diaspora history and reality. So in this case, it's an African American reality and history mixed with Jamaican folklore, supernatural and sci-fi. And I chose to submit my story to the Commonwealth Short Story Prize 2023 because I've done it before a number of times. This is the first I've, I've, I've ever reached and I am still in a state of shock. Um, it's surreal, but I'm grateful and I live in gratitude because of being selected. Because I'm in the 6,000th entries. No, that is well, 6,000 entries and I'm one of the shortlisted, so I'm just blown away. And like I said, I'm still in shock. I probably will celebrate tonight, actually, because I'm still in shock. Stories make up our lives. We are stories. Our st they say our lives are books, which they are, they, which, which have their own chapters. Everywhere around us are stories. Everything is a story, has a story, has its place. And I'm fortunate enough to be a storyteller. I agree to tell these stories in the way that I do tell them, engaging, provoking, enabling discussions, debate, and so on and so forth. So I'm grateful that I'm able to be a storyteller in this time to tell the stories that many people don't actually hear about, and especially focus on the African diaspora and it's the, the richness of, and the wealth of stories that exist within, within the African diaspora in itself.